Dexter, at first you might think might remind you of a show or an insult, but now a robotic arm by the same name is changing our future. Reporter Lucas Turner tells us more. Dexter is a modular robotic arm with a variety of applications and extreme precision. It can utilize a variety of attachments such as a vacuum tube, a pen, or even any 3D printed part made to fit on the end. Inventor Kent Gilson says that it will even be able to build itself. Dexter is a project I started about five years ago to, uh, to uh, create a robot that could actually build itself and build and therefore build kind of anything else. So the idea is they could, uh, you know, reproduce. According to Gilson, Dexter can accomplish this goal of building itself because it's made of 3D printed parts along with being operated by a supercomputer to make movement as precise as possible. The actual physical uh, architecture of the machine is designed around being able to be 3D printed. Um, and that's uh, very difficult to do and keep a precise robot. And so the other really big advantage that we've got is we've got a supercomputer. It's, a, it's an FPGA, it's called a Field Programmable Gate Array, which is a parallel supercomputer that allows us to do signal processing or be able to process uh, the uh, information coming from the sensor systems so quickly and so precisely that we're able to measure out the mechanical errors of the actual system. Dexter is precise down to five microns or five millionths of a meter. In comparison, human hairs are about only 100 microns thick. It is also so sensitive to touch that it can detect a cotton ball being dropped onto it. A way that this could apply to the average user, Gilson says, is to eventually incorporate this technology into video games. A very high resolution sense of touch. And because of that, um, the uh, device also acts as a haptic interface. It can actually either apply force or it can fill force. So you can use that, uh, that information, that touch information, to turn this into a, uh, a high resolution haptic game controller. So you could, you know, two people with two uh, remote de dexters could actually have a sword fight remotely and actually fill, you know, the swords banging together. The project is currently being funded through Kickstarter. If you want to learn more, follow the link on fstnews.com. For Lucas Turner, this has been Noah Farrar, FST News. Thanks, Lucas and Noah. Hopefully, Dexter can become a reality and change the technology, technology industry.